Hello everyone. Very glad to present our work in WACB 2022, the picture prior guided face debris. The author are Su Hyun Jung and Taebong Lee and Professor Yong Seok Ho. We are from Aju University. I am Su Hyun Jung. The topic of this paper is face debris, which aim to recover facial details from a broad face image. As image deblurring is highly ill post, the key of the face deblurring is to utilize strong facial prior. The current mainstream of face deblurring methods are to use facial shape priors, such as face landmark and parsing map. Meanwhile, several methods try to optimize perceptual loss to restore facial texture details. They extract the pictures from face recognition network to minimize the distance in picture space between the predict and ground truth image. The key problem of facial shape priors are insufficient to contain local texture details. They are highly biased toward the global shape of the face. The existing methods which aim to enrich texture details typically train their models using a combined objective function consisting of a pixel loss and perceptual loss. However, there are two problems. First, they do not use the picture as facial prior. Second, they minimize both perceptual loss in picture space for the recognition and pixel-wise loss in image space for the fidelity from a single estimate image. This is because some recognition features may be not optimal solution for the restoration. Therefore, we propose a novel depictor prior guided network, the EpiZNet, which utilizes the estimated depictors as spatial prior by considering the difference between deblurring and recognition in a single network. The picture can be a strong prior because it contains rich information including face texture and facial shape. This is the overall framework of the EpiZNet. The generator of the EpiZNet consists of prior estimation stream and deep learning stream. First, the encoder of deep learning stream extracts pictures from a broad face image. Second, prior estimation stream estimates the picture prior with the supervision of ground truth the pictures. Third, the decoder of the blurring stream restores a detailed face image with the help of the estimate the picture priors. However, there is a gap between pictures for recognition and pictures for the blurring. To consider this problem, we further propose two solutions. First is to propose to place picture transfer module at the connecting point of the two streams. Second is to propose channel attention discriminator and prior rows. The special picture transfer module aims to elevate the discrepancy of picture distribution between prior estimation stream and deep stream. The channel attention picture discriminator and prior loss aims to focus on training more important channels for deblurring among the deep picture priors. The channel attention picture discriminator runs the weight of the important channels of the pictures for deblurring by classifying the ground truth and generating the pictures. Prior loss transfers important information of ground truth the pictures for deblurring to generator using round weight by giving more weight on important channels for deblurring. We experiment on two official facial deblurring dataset, Shen test set and MSP test set. The results show that our method achieves state of the art performance compared to other methods. The qualitative results show that our method can produce more fine texture and details of facial components. For more information, please check our paper and GitHub. If you have any question, please email to my email address. Thank you for watching.